how to connect MailChimp to your Shopify store. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can connect your MailChimp account to your Shopify e-commerce store. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to first off create your own MailChimp account and create your own Shopify account. And for this video, to connect your MailChimp and Shopify accounts, you're gonna have to have a administrative role or a owner role on both of these platforms. So you can't connect them with only remote roles you need to make sure that you are either a owner or the administrator on MailChimp so to get started with linking our MailChimp account to our Shopify e-commerce store the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to go on to our MailChimp account so this is going to be your MailChimp dashboard and on your dashboard you're going to go on to your left over here and you're going to find integration so you're going to find this integrations tab you're just going to click on it and then you're going to click on add new over here and then you can find different apps and integrations on their uh, marketplace and you can see all the basic integrations are present over here so if you scroll down you're going to find e-commerce integrations and within those e-commerce integrations you're going to find shopify if you can't find it like that you can just type in the search bar you can type in shopify and you can press enter and then you're going to have shopify over here so once you have shopify over here you're just going to click on shopify like that and after that you're just going to click on connect new site and then this is going to open up your mailchimp slash shopify account and you're going to click on add app just like that and now you're going to have to choose the shopify account so i already have my account over here and i'm going to just link that account or you can log into a different account if you want to uh, connect your mailchimp to a different shopify account but just like that i'm going to click on over here and now you can see over here that is going to tell me that i'm able to install mailchimp into my jane doe store and then you can click on these various categories to install the application so you can see over here the first thing mailchimp will be able to do is view my shop data edit customers so you can see that this is one of the most important elements is that MailChimp will be able to determine what kind of customers are what and then you have your view products you have your view orders so they're going to be able to view who is buying what and what kind of orders are being fulfilled and then you're just going to click on install application over here just like that and this is just going to sync up your MailChimp email marketing and your Shopify store. So after that, they give you a pre-install checklist and then you're just going to read that out and you can continue. And now you're just going to click on connect over here. And then you're just going to have to re-log into your MailChimp account. So I will do that and I will get back to you guys in a second. So once you have done that, they're going to ask you if you authorize MailChimp for Shopify. You're just going to click on allow over here. And now MailChimp and Shopify are going to be integrated. And now you can see over here that your Shopify store is going to ask you what audience do you want to sync up with your MailChimp account. So we want the JDO Inc. one. And then you're going to see these tags over here. So you're going to add your customer tag and I would recommend that you make sure to add these so although this is an optional category I like to add like a specific kind of tag so I like to add the VIP tag over here and you can also have a double opt-in so you can turn off or on the settings for Jane Doe Inc changing this will usually give you a uh, better opt-in setting on MailChimp but I don't like to change this and then you have your merge tags as well so any kind of uh, tags you want to merge you can do that as well but I'm going to skip that but make sure you do enter your Shopify customer tags because this will really help you segment your customer marketing according to the customers that you have now after that you're just going to click on sync audience and then this is going to be the third step so you have your initial sync time and then you have your automations and then you're just going to continue to overview and in the meanwhile your audiences are being synced so you can see over here that your store is in queue to start syncing at any moment so it will just refresh and automatically show me when it has been completely synced in so this is how simple and easy it is to integrate your mailchimp email marketing into your shopify e-commerce store so you can see over here that our MailChimp and our Shopify store have been synced up. So over here we have our synced audience, the products, the consumers, orders, subscribe, transactional and unsubscribe. Then you also have any kind of running promo codes you can monitor from here. You can have your Shopify customer tag mapper and categorize different Shopify customers. And then you also have your double opt-ins over here. So you can change these as you go and customize these according to your business and according to the number of products or customers that you currently have. So I only have added myself into my emailing list that's why it's only one subscriber but obviously you're going to have more subscribers according to the people that you've added into your MailChimp audience so the more people you have in your MailChimp audience the more people are going to be able to send like 
discount codes with uh, for your e-commerce store so you can send them discount codes you can send them newsletters whatever you might want and you can also leave like a sign up form on your shopify store so from your shopify store you can go into home and then you can leave a sign up form and then using the sign up form you can collect people's emails and then start sending them emails via mailchimp and now both of these are integrated you really can automate this entire process as well so these are some of the great things about these online platforms is that they are available online so you can access them from anywhere you don't have to download anything so the great part about these platforms is that these are available online so you don't have to download mailchimp or you don't have to download shopify to actually access your entire e-commerce store or your entire email marketing system and since these are available online you can use them on your desktop you can use these applications on your phone as well so you can really manage your entire e-commerce store directly from your phone you don't even need to have a laptop to manage everything but all of this does come with a price so shopify is not available for free but mailchimp is so you can create your e-commerce store with another kind of e-commerce provider like equid for free if you want to run like a completely free setup for like both mailchimp and your store but if you're using shopify you're probably having to pay for a premium so that is why i love to use shopify and equid because they're both available online although shopify is a paid only kind of application shopify is one of the greatest e-commerce providers out there so that is why i do think that using mailchimp for free and using shopify's paid version is probably the best combination that you're gonna get in terms of marketing for email marketing and in terms of e-commerce store so you can easily create your store there are so many templates available on Shopify and it is easily 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 integrated with applications like MailChimp and other integrations that you want to add they're all available on Shopify or MailChimp and you can easily sync up everything and everything is so simply and uh, easily compatible so to take a look at the prices of both Shopify and MailChimp Shopify starts at $29 per month and it goes up to their advanced version starting at $299 dollars so there are different features and you can go into detail over here and you can see the different features like the amount of stores you can create how many products you can add how many staff accounts you can create what are your inventory locations all that good stuff you can find the details over here and for mailchimp they have a free version that you can send over 2,000 emails with but if you exceed 2,000 emails you're going to have to upgrade to the essentials version starting at $11 per month or the standard version starting at 17 or the premium starting at 200 and 99 so i do think using a standard version in combination with the shopify's basic version is probably one of the best ways to run your marketing your email marketing and your e-commerce store they're easy to integrate and they're pretty simple and seamless when you're using them so i hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to integrate your email marketing into your shopify store or integrate your shopify store into your mailchimp account make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the youtube channel for more content like this and share this video with anyone you think might need it anyone that might want some help out with their mailchimp or with their shopify account and if you have any questions make sure to leave them in the comment box down below and i will make sure to answer them as soon as possible and i will catch you guys in the next video